let's take the case of uh, a customer who is actually using SAP AFS as of today. So you have to be on a certain AFS release to be able to actually do a one-step migration. So the start release for AFS is SAP AFS 6.0, and uh, you can be on any database. So anyways, SAP AFS doesn't run on HANA as of now. So what you, the, the first step for an AFS customer is to convert or is to move into an SAP FMS solution. So here you can see there are two boxes. One is SAP FMS with SAP S4 HANA Finance as an add-on. The other one is, uh, with, is SAP FMS with uh, uh, the ERP Financial, so without S4 HANA Finance. So both options are possible. So if you're an AFS customer, you can move to an SAP FMS today and then move to SAP S4 HANA after Q3 or Q4 of 2017. So that's the first release which will be out. So based on your implementation scope, uh, you can take a call on whether 2017 is, is the best time or is it 2018. And uh, as of now, uh, there is, uh, as I said, there's no direct path between AFS and S4 HANA but SAP are looking into it and they would be providing an option to move from AFS into S4 HANA going forward. But uh, as of now, this is the option that is available. And as you can see here, when you actually move from an SAP AFS to an SAP FMS environment, it's going to be a new implementation. It's going to be a new implementation and uh, SAP does provide a data migration tool called DTNT which would uh, help in migrating transaction data from an AFS into an FMS uh, application. 